Hey, Everett. Hey, Everett. Chef Jamie Gwynn, my friend, it's always a pleasure to have you. I'm so glad to be back with you. How are you? <laughs> I am doing wonderful, and thank God for that, and I hope you are as well. Thank you. We are. I appreciate you asking. Thank you. Well, folks, thank you for we got to figure me back. out. You are, sir, look, it's always a pleasure to have you back. Well, folks, we got to figure out what is celebrity chef Jamie Gwynn is doing to get her family back to the table with some of these snacks and meals. I'm telling with delight itself. And with that being said, uh, Jamie, how can we take, I guess, our dinners beyond some of the ordinary? You got it. And it's a great question, right? Because busy weeknights are officially back, Everett. And I love being back with you. But I thought I would share some of my favorite ingredients to sort of amp up your weeknight meal, right? Because now's the time that we want to add big, bold flavor. I love the fall season, in fact. And so these are my best sort of pantry go-tos, I guess you'd call them, uh, my arsenal of secret ingredients. So we love Bush's beans, right? But if you haven't tasted Bush's sidekicks, they come in four flavorful varieties. There's Southwest Zest Pinto beans, Rustic Tuscany chickpeas, Taco Fiesta black beans and Cimarron Caribbean black beans. And they add that burst of flavor to every meal, like as a go-to side dish, as a simple mix-in for your favorite salad. I love that they're protein packed, the beans, of course, but uh, I use the Bush's Cimarron Caribbean variety the most because they have this sort of sweet, savory sauce and colorful peppers and uh, Jamaican jerk style spices. They work great alongside cilantro rice, a grilled chicken breast. It's just a really simple, fabulous way to add exciting flavor to your favorite meal. Uh, that's definitely ever one of my go-tos. Now, Chef Jamie, talk about though, how, how can we uh, save time in the kitchen? Yeah, of course, you can actually save time and money. And I've always said this by keeping a well-stocked pantry. And these are all pantry staples for me, whether they actually come out of the cabinet or your fridge. Uh, this one I should tell you, I should probably carry in my purse. I use it that much because I love it. Um, this is making the most of a one ingredient wonder. So a great way to add a pop of flavor is always with a great sauce. And Lee Kum Ki is the leading maker of authentic Asian sauces and condiments for over a century now. So it's easy to upgrade your meals and offer that unexpected twist of bold flavor with the Lee Kum Ki Sriracha Mayo you get the best combination of your favorite condiments. You get sriracha and mayonnaise, right? Made using cage-free eggs. It's gluten-free, which I love. It's creamy, it's got a hint of heat, and it really does elevate a sandwich or a wrap. I use it in a marinade. I love it as a dip. It's just so good. And then Everett, I have to show you this because I never met anybody who didn't love a tortilla or pie, right? That's and right. I like That's to right. make the most... Oh yeah, I, come on. I mean, find me someone, right? <laughs> I like to make the most of seasonal ingredients. So it's apple season. So these are apple pie taquitos. Now, mm. everything you love about a crispy taquito with apple pie, I mean, how could it be bad? I like Chi Chi's brand tortillas. I find them the tastiest. Uh, they're low in fat. They're really baked beautifully. They come in lots of varieties like fajita style and burrito style. And so I use them for mealtime and snack time. And then what's left in the package, I love to roll into this super simple, yummy dessert. So I saute some sliced apples with cinnamon, sugar, pinch of salt to elevate the flavor. Then I roll that apple pie filling in a tortilla brush it with butter, and I don't fry it. I bake them for about 15 minutes in a hot oven, and you get hand-held perfection. Scoop of vanilla bean ice cream, so good. I tell you, I, I tell you, my mouth is watering. And then, uh, <laughs> Jamie, any last minutes, uh, I guess, suggestions uh, to c continue to talk about what will bring us to the table? Sure, of course. I think that dressing the table is definitely a topic of conversation. The holidays are coming up. So I made something for you, Everett, which I think is beautiful. And it's so simple, too. You can do it at home. Take any taper candle, could be tall, short, thin, thick, and wrap cinnamon sticks around the edge. Now, I put a rubber band around it. This is my secret. And then I slide the cinnamon sticks in. Then I wrap a ribbon around the outside. But when you light the candle, that beautiful aroma 
of the cinnamon wafts through the house. And what a wonderful way to embrace the season, right? By the way, the recipes are posted at dailylounge.com. You'll want to steal those. And then more tips and tricks like this to set a beautiful table with recipes galore as well on social at Chef Jamie Gwen. But don't miss dailylounge.com because trust me, you want this recipe. Always a pleasure to have my friend, a former master chef judge, celebrity chef, Jamie Gwynn, dailylounge.com, and as you know her handle. Jamie, always a pleasure to have you on the show. Everett, it's my delight. Thank you. Happy fall to you, my friend. I'll see you soon, I hope. Uh, okay, thanks. Bye-bye.